Hey guys, thanks for stopping by. And if you're new here, be sure to hit that subscribe button so you can catch more videos. So today I'm doing a do-it-yourself sea glass. So this is a Dollar Tree DIY. I have here a nice large vase. Also have some food coloring and some Mod Podge. Also a brush and I'm using the blue and green to make a teal color and you'll need a bowl to mix it. Okay, so now I'm just adding the Mod Podge into the bowl and I don't have an exact measurement. I'm just adding enough where I think it's enough to cover the glass. So now I'm gonna add three drops of the blue food coloring and two of the green. And we're just gonna mix that all together. So here is the color you wanna get. Beautiful color here. So now you're just going to take that and paint it right onto the glass vase. Nothing special, just try to keep a pretty thin layer and pretty uh, even strokes. And then you'll see that this comes out beautiful. So you can put this in the oven to dry, but I'm just letting it air dry. I haven't tried it um, drying it in the oven yet, but I probably will try that one day just to see if it's a different effect from the air dry. So here it is all dried and you can see the beautiful like teal sea glass effect. So now I'm just going to add some decorations to it. I have this dog um, toy here. It was like a chew toy. I cut off the edges that had these long um, edges that were not braided up. So I just cut that off and now I'm just going to hot glue this right onto the glass. Okay, so now I have this twine. It comes three to a pack, and you, you can find it in, like, the automobile section at Dollar Tree. It comes with two of those tan ones and a green one. So now I'm just adding a little hot glue um, to the start of it, and I'm just going to wrap it all the way around until I feel it's enough. So now I just have this seashell um, and I spray painted that with a little bit of light blue and pink and I'm just going to glue that onto the twine. So here I have this circular styrofoam, it comes two to a pack, and all I did was place the vase upside down on it and cut it to size so that the center I can pop out and add it right onto the vase. So I added some seashells on the bottom and this LED uh, pillar candle from Dollar Tree. This is all from Dollar Tree. So I have these beautiful burlap flowers and I'm just going to take them right off the stems and hot glue them onto that styrofoam. So here you go, this is the finished project. There you can see the seashells on the bottom underneath the candle. 
and I just love this sea glass effect. I will be doing plenty of more projects with this. The beautiful burlap flowers. So you guys, I'm going to be doing my bathroom over and I'm giving it like a spa retreat um, theme. So this is going to be going in that bathroom. And also I'm doing, I did some DIY floating shelves. So that video will be coming soon as well. So be sure to check back for uh, more DIYs that I'll be adding in that spa retreat bathroom. And then I'll give you the reveal very soon as well. So here's the project in the dark so you can see it um what it would look like with the candles lit and i just think it's beautiful and it's gonna look absolutely beautiful in my spa retreat bathroom <laughs> so thanks for watching guys i hope you guys enjoyed if you did give me a thumbs up leave me a comment let me know what you think about the sea glass effect and if you're gonna try it out and be sure to come back and check for more videos and i will catch you in the next video peace out